and I don't have to press on the trigger, I just push. Today, let's take a look at DeWalt's new drywall gun. This thing is really awesome. I'm in love with it and I'm gonna show you what it does. This comes with a belt clip that you can put on the left or the right hand side, super handy. The tool itself is very similar to the old model as far as the size of it. It's a little bit smaller but it has some cool functions on it. Up top here, we have the mode selector. So I'm gonna throw a battery in this so you can see the different modes. I like to use the power stack batteries because they're super small, super light, and they're gonna last a long time. We have a light down here, which is great, shines right up into my workspace. So in mode one, this is the slow speed. Mode two is a faster speed. This mode right here, is when you put a screw on the front and it'll just drive it in automatically. You don't have to press the trigger. And then the last mode is when all three lights are lit up. So as soon as I pull this trigger, it's a constant run. You have so many different modes in here to select what you need to do when you're drywalling. Okay, so let's jam some screws in here. First, we're gonna use the mode that I like the most, which is two lights on. So that means I just put the screw in and I don't have to press on the trigger, I just push. And that's it. So that's a really nice feature to have. Next will be the constant run mode. So I'll put the screw on, I'll switch it to constant run. Now I'll press the trigger. Press it again to turn it off. Then we have the other modes, which is mode two. That's where I hold down the trigger and the RPMs are spinning at the highest point. And then mode one, which is slower. So really handy, then you can give this a twist and you can drive the screws in or you can take them out. The front is also magnetized, which helps hold those screws in place. You also have a belt clip up here, so you can just clip this right on to anything. And one great feature is if you don't drive a screw in deep enough or you're in a corner, you can just give this a quick twist, pulls off, and you can drive that screw in a little bit deeper or you can reverse it out. We have forward and reverse button right here as well. So same spot as always. This is just such a nice tool to use. I'm so impressed. I lent this to my drywaller for a day and he absolutely loves it. He's gonna go out and buy one of his own and replace the current tool that he's using. You can also get a magazine right here. This is the newer model and it slides right over top. The magazine comes with a bit and it is a great addition to this tool. All right guys, this is my new favorite tool right now. Hope the video was helpful. Until next time, keep on crushing it, and we'll catch you later.